Hello, Tribe Forex traders. Today is March 17th, 2015, and uh, yesterday we had a pretty good trading day. Uh, we traded the uh, euro dollar, I think, was what was taken. And so we did well on that, hitting the first take profit, second position moved to break even, ended up, um, volatility ended up kicking it out. Great trade there. Um, we also had some other trades that worked out for us as well. So let's take a look at what we're looking for going forward. So we're still looking for a sell bias, but we're kind of in a consolidation right now. What we're going to look for, I'm going to go to the daily chart on the euro dollar specifically, is 1.0700 for a sell. We chose that level because it is an area of support and resistance. If you look on the four hour, we've got a 50 EMA right there. Um, so, you know, that's what we're looking for on the euro dollar. On the dollar Swiss, we're going to look for 1.10015 for a buy. Okay? So 1.0015. Um, that was the previous day's low. Uh, we're going to be looking for price to come back to that area. Give us another shot at it. You can see here we got very, very close to our entry, by the way, at one uh, at parity 1.0000. Um, yesterday didn't quite hit that mark on the pound dollar we're looking for a sell at 1.4845 which is at the highs of this consolidation that we've been on here on the four hour um, look in the daily you can see that very well that we've just continually gotten back to these highs we've got an in inside breakout opportunity here so we've got one big bar followed by two smaller bars that are inside that bigger bar there's a consolidation pattern and eventually there's going to be a breakout that's going to emerge that is a probability that uh, of of that happening or a high probability of that happening for us so we're looking for 1.4845 there dollar yen we've got no trade aussie dollar no trade here on the new zealand though new zealand dollar um, showed us promise yesterday we're going to look for it again we actually made some money on the new zealand yesterday um, so we took a so if you're a part of the um, the trade copier, we took a New Zealand trade here, made some profits. We're looking for price to get back up to 0 0.7400. And if the market gets back up to 0 0.7400, we're going to sell off of that level, okay? And look for future price movement. And this goes in line with trend lines, goes in line with are obviously the double zeros and our area of support and resistance our uh, previous day's high okay so that's that on the new zealand 0 0.7400 sell pound yen no trade dollar cad no trade and on the euro yen so on the euro yen we're going to look for going down to the lower time frame we also have consolidation there and there's actually a nice what we looks like a uh, reversal candle that we can take a trade off of, but for our purposes, we're looking for price to get to 12900. And if it does get to 12900, we're going to get back into a sell here on the euro yen, 12900. Okay, and guys, that is it for our calls for today. I uh, look forward to seeing you tomorrow. We actually have new strategies that are coming out that are going to blow your mind. They're doing phenomenally well. And we're looking forward to uh, being able to profit with you going forward. All the best, guys. That's all I got for you today. Talk to you tomorrow. Bye-bye.